We are here in Nalgonda district and Nalgonda constituency of Telangana and I have with me very senior Congress leader Komat Reddy Venkat Reddy who happens to be the MP from Bongir but is contesting an assembly election. What is the reason that an MP has to contest an assembly election? Is it lack of talent in the Congress party? No, party I came and decided to contest all three MPs, myself and Uthungma Reddy including PC's president also. Member of Parliament, as per the I came in direction, I am contesting my old candidacy, where I am represented this for 20 years. So um, now I am again coming to assembly. Okay. This time round, uh, your, your party after 2014, 2018 finally seems to be having some momentum. But is it enough to reduce the gap because you almost had what 17 percent gap uh, between your two parties 29 percent and 47 percent so that much gap will you be able to cover even if you have some momentum no as per my surveys and my personal survey i conducted as a star campaigner with my own uh, resources we have crossed that we are gap between prs and congress is 9.5 percent now we are more than if you want i will give but keep it uh, confidential because uh, we don't want to, so we want to, our cadre will uh, work on them, they will not work for five, more than five days, you are going to election. So you see my, I am started my campaign every day at the six o'clock and uh, completing 11 o'clock, just taking only two hours just. So we are comfortable position. You see the face of KCR and KDR, how they are talking rubbish talks every day they are criticizing congress you want congress or current means wouldn't you say that uh, you know two terms of the uh, kcr government there have been good schemes welfare schemes they've spent a lot on uh, welfare schemes like raitu bandhu or pension schemes those are successful schemes and people are happy with those schemes no no not uh, not for schemes or uh, bandhu or sheep or fishes we got the Lengana, we brought the Lengana, fighting for six decades. We lost in first moment 369 police, 369 youth in police firing. At the time of Indira Gandhi, Indira Gandhi not given the Lengana. The second movement started in 1999. Before KCR, he was in power as a deputy speaker. I am MLA at the time, 1999. 41 MLS elected from the Telangana. CLP leader was the Rajshak Reddy. But is Telangana still an, you know, uh, Telangana sentiment still an election issue? Because if it is Telangana sentiment, then KCR will say, I brought Telangana. Of course, there is some, uh, there is goodwill that Congress gave Telangana, Sonia Gandhi gave Telangana. But is that the issue or is there development or the allegations of corruption that you are making? Is that the issue in this election? No, no, in this election. Public, yeah, all saw what what promises he made in the uh, Telangana movement period started in 2001 by TRS party. Telangana, if Telangana found first CM is the Dalit CM, I am only for a uh, watchdog. Since then he started lot of lies, and 2018 before three three four days before polling. He put the money in the account in the name of Raith Bandhu. We can't uh, stop that because of farmers' issue. So that is the poll India also in my conscience. In Alwanda, where I won four terms, the Natesh winning four terms consecutively. Poll India also two lakh, three lakh, four lakh. That is the second time. This time public was exposed. It's family rule, number one, and corruption is a number two. Dharani and College Forum, one Medigata Barrage, and next one Sunil and Annaram Barrage also. Next rainy season, they two barriers also washed out. Already the Government of India, Central Water Commission, told that one. So, so are you thinking that this is an election about whether KCR should get it a third term? Is it about anti-incumbency against the MLAs of the BRS, which are, who have been also sitting MLAs for 10 years? Yeah, that is a good question. Anti income is the one one and corruption of the MLAs and ministers and chief ministers' family. 
you example take it his own daughter that uh, what happened in the liquor scam and uh, collision and dharani portal was the biggest scam i saw because my parliament area comes under ibrahim patnam adipatla a lot of it companies there all trs mlas mps belongs to telangana purchased the assigned lands and converted into provisional list but now the cm is in every meeting saying that if you remove dharani portal uh, you will not get raitu bandhu money have you been able to stop that campaign or been able to discredit that campaign because obviously the two may not be related what is the connection between raitu bandhu and dharani dharani what is the dharani is a subesh kumar brain child to corrupt he is the most one of the corrupt officer of in india he is a real estate man in nights also will go to the sea and he was the chief minister so because i can't take mr somesh kumar's uh, rebuttal no, no, I, on this I, I, therefore i have to come I'm to this i'm going to bind there is no connection to raitu bandhu to dharani dharani means lot of assign land and uh, lavani patra lands or ground wakpu land only powers given to mro and collector in revenue act I am MLA and Minister in Administration. I know the RDO is the main revenue for the lands, and next giant collector is the final. No need of collector's uh, thumb impression. So the centralisation you are saying has led to corruption. Yes, that that is how oh, one MRO and one collector's thumb impression is enough. I saw la I I after nine to I only present I may be in cabinet. Okay, let's come to this question. You are saying your surveys are showing that the Congress is winning hands down, right? So now the most important question when the Congress comes to power is who will be Chief Minister? Because you seem to have multiple candidates always for Chief Minister. Not multiple candidates. Four or five can senior candidates is there. After the election result came, all MLAs will elect the CLP leader with the. one observer will come one or two they will take individual opinions you see in himachal pradesh what happened prajwa party the wife of late five term chief minister prajwa singh he is not elected as clp leader he was not a cm sukhvinder singh who was not in aspirant was not aspirant as cm he became the cm because mla voted is important in So, will you have a non-ready as a CM here? Because Congress has always had a history of ready CMs. Uh, you said uh, KCR had promised a Dalit CM, did not fulfil it. Will the Congress consider a non-ready CM? Okay, I am ready. If the MLA told Dalit or non-ready is okay, we want to remove KCR as CM to save the Telangana. It's already yesterday also Nirmala Sitharaman gave the statement. Five lakhs eighty thousand crores debates. This is one of the is a surplus budget state. Where is the money gone? One now is not built. So are you bill. putting your hat also in the ring for CM? No, no, no. After the my I am satisfied with my MLA to take care my conscience and I am maybe the senior of one of the senior most leader in the Congress party among the all. I am in 1986. I am the when Rajiv Gandhi is there. I am the NSP State General Secretary. So ultimately, I am the. The video that has gone viral, where you are saying that you are the senior most, and Sonia Gandhi will select you to become the Chief Minister as well. Yes, Sonia Gandhi will take. Karya Ji will take. Rahul Priyanka is, is there. They will take the MLA's opinion, and they will decide the CM. Whatever the result comes, we are ready to work for the party. We are to work for the unemployed youth. We are. We are only to save the Telangana piece. Telangana given, Sonia Gandhi no. If Telangana gives, we will politically we will lose in Andhra Pradesh. But what is the result ultimately? One family, nine families. One other accusation against the Congress is that you know after they won in the election in 2018, they split the party and went away. This time also, the chance is there, uh, isn't it? There, I mean, that if you fall short of a majority, and uh, there can be uh, MLAs who come from the Congress, uh, going to the BJP, maybe going to the BRS, maybe. In Telangana, there is no B, no BJP. They may get two, the, two or three seats. But after your question is correct. If we not get the sufficient majority, 
that problem is there. So there is no problem. We are crossing 75. Now we are in 70s. After Priyanka's and Rahul road shows from tomorrow, definitely we will cross 80 to 85. But you then, are also afraid that if we fall short, that problem of... Uh, I have doubt. A lot of people will go. KCR is a... That, that, mind, that mindset man, in place of other... other uh, like KCR, they will not take. But you see, last election, he own elected 88 MPs, 88 MLA. Why they, why they purchase 13 MLAs with each MLA with 100 to 200 MLA, 200 crores? We, are, we can't believe one of the worst CM in India is a KCR. Is buying the MLAs is not correct. Who given the Congress, given the Congress, Telangana, why are you killing the Congress party? Is it a problem because many outsiders have come into the Congress, like you have been in your party for a long time, but there are imports into the Congress. Is there that division? No, that division, they are, they are, they are, they are inquired about their character and winning chance only, when only we given the ticket, but uh, there is no, you are, you are doubting that, but <laughs> we are winning more than 85 seats. After third afternoon, I will give. If we not cross 80, I will resign my from, from post. Okay. Okay. So that's a very confident Mr. Uh, Komat Reddy, Venkat Reddy, who is in fact claiming that uh, they are going to get a comfortable majority, but he doesn't rule out that if they fall short of a majority, there could be a chance of horse trading, and he doesn't put it past either his MLAs or the Chief Minister, uh, who is the President of the PRS. In Nalgunda with uh, camera person Nagraju Masudhir, NDTV.